Welcome back to the channel, YouTube. And if this is your first time coming, you are locked into the channel now. We appreciate you guys coming through. We're about to do a review about the Yakita Tactical Vest or just a chest plate carrier, guys. And it's super sweet. This thing will most definitely give you some protection, especially if you pick the right plates and things like that to go on the front and the back to protect yourself. But if you want one for a cost effective low price, you've came to the right place and you're watching the right video also. It's a lot out there, but I think that you guys are most definitely gonna like this one. Having one of these is part of protection, guys. Some people keep them in their trunks, you know, depending on what state you're in, but they will most definitely keep you protected or give you more added protection. And speaking of protection, check this out real quick, guys. Don't risk getting sued if you're ever in a self-defense situation. Protect your family responsibly. Right to Bear offers elite protection along with many other great benefits. Their plans offer more than just legal reimbursement to secure your peace of mind. Like civil defense, criminal defense, all states in the United States except New York, New Jersey, and Washington, psychological support, expert witness defense, gun replacement, accidental discharge, self-defense training videos, discount to industry partners, spousal coverage, minor children defense, multi-state defense, bail bond coverage, $100,000 max, and 24-7 attorney answered hotline. Let Right the Bear give you a peace of mind. You can sign up by clicking on a link in the description of this video, and subscribers get special discounts for joining, guys. Having protection in all areas is never a bad thing, guys. So without further ado, let's go ahead and jump into this review. So let's jump into it, guys. I know if you've been looking online for tactical vests or a plate carrier, they're extremely expensive. However, I did find this on Amazon at a very, very low price. And check out the link in the description below. Uh, if you click on it, it'll send you straight to where you can actually purchase this. But this baby right here has a sweet, sweet price, guys. I promise. So let's go ahead and jump into it. So let's check it out here. I still have it in the uh, plastic right here, guys. So let's look at it here. And when I tell you this boy is quality, man, I was like freaking surprised. Now, when you see it online, it looks pretty good. But when you see it in person, it's even better, guys. I promise. All right. I'm gonna go ahead and put it together here. It comes in two different separate parts, the front uh, plate carrier, and then you have the uh, back. So I'm gonna go ahead and uh, buckle it for you, just so you can see how it looks. That's it right there. And I mean, so sweet. It doesn't have the plates on the side to protect you, but I mean, we're not going to war or anything like that. And if you are going to war, this is not the, plate carrier for you or the tactical vest for you at all uh, but it has does have somewhat of a, a cummerbund on the side or a waist uh, strap if you want to call it that so pretty freaking sweet all right the material is 1000 D nylon it is water resistant and I'm gonna go ahead and here and show you the uh, velcro here where you can actually I'm pretty sure you can see that you can go ahead and put your badges on the front there. They also have an area here where you can put your badges on the back of it too, uh, which is pretty cool. And they have it in those areas. I don't think they have it in any other areas on here, uh, but it is on the front and the back. It also has Molly panels here, guys. All right, so if you can see it, the Molly panels are right there. You have your Molly panels there. That's on the front of the plate carrier the tactical vest and then on the back of it you can see the molly panels right here too so you have it right there also and that way you can uh weave in certain type of attachments and things like that uh if you need to add anything on the front uh, or if you need to add it i mean if you need to add anything on the back or if you need to add anything on the front there you also have it right on the side uh, that you can see in this cummerbund area too. So you have those molly panels there also. It has breathable uh, cushioned areas. All right, guys, on the straps, and I'm gonna unbuckle these to show you real quick. And it also has the padded area on the front um, of the plate carrier right here, 
right there you can see the padded area all right and it's not soft to the touch it's a little firm but you need that if you ever get hit with a bullet so right there uh, you have it there there and also here too all right this is the front of the uh of the vest and then also you have it here on the back of the back of the vest here so you can see it also in sections here right there all right and then they also included it in the shoulder straps now a lot of people always are concerned about these i noticed when i listen to them online they really really want some comfort in the shoulders because the plates will actually weigh you down depending on how heavy the plates are if your plates are heavier then you're most definitely going to need this cushion but this just helps anyway so that's the cushion that you get and the breathable material that's up under there also guys so you get that uh, on your shoulder straps right there that you buckle down now i'm gonna go ahead guys real quick and give you a close-up of this vest and we're going to go into some particulars about the actual vest uh, I want to do close-ups on these for you guys to show you some of the features that it has. So this is the back part of the carrier. And of course, um, it has adjustable padded shoulder straps here. Okay, so let me show you how these work. Just the Velcro here, and you can adjust it in that area. And this even Velcros up here in this area where you can adjust it and make it shorter or longer to your liking. Okay, and you just simply just fold it back on top of it right there. And that's on both um, of the straps here too that you can do that on to make it more comfortable for you. <clears throat> it also has adjustable waist uh, straps with tension bands or some may call them like the cummerbund area, which has molly panels uh, right here that you can see where you can add your attachments and things of that nature. You also have your AR-15 uh, magazine pouch right here. You can also put full-size magazines in this area right here also in this mag pouch area. And you can unsnap the pouch and add, you know, different one if you want to. And this is how you do it here. Just unsnap it, and right there you see it molly webbed in the inside, and of course you can put different pouches uh, and things of that nature in that area here. All right, and I'll go ahead, and snap it back down, and that's pretty cool that you can change that out if you want to, and it just simply snaps back in place. You also have your quick release right here, and I'm gonna show you in the video, in the conclusionary part of the video, how this works. Um, I'll try it on, but you have that right here, the quick release, and then you can take your finger with this little loop. Um, you just pull up and it'll unsnap it and you can do that on both sides to take the vest off. You also have right here your tension bands, all right, right there. And then these tension bands allow you to be able to put the magazine in the inside and you just lift up on this tension band and it holds down that magazine inside the pouch area here. I wanna go ahead and show you guys this area right here. You can un-Velcro this area, all right? And then you have a tension band right here. You can tighten and loosen that up right here. And then you also have um, your shorter tension bands in that area right here, which allows you to be able um, to take this waist strap off or cummerbund, if you wanna call it that. You can actually take this off and you probably can attach different ones to it. All right, so I'll go ahead and fold that down. All right, so let's get to the front of the carrier here, which is pretty cool, man. This thing, guys, when I tell you for the price that you're gonna pay for it, you would think that it wouldn't be of such good quality. It is freaking amazing quality. The material is like freaking hardcore. You'll see when you order it, the link will be in the description. Uh, of the video when you order it you'll see exactly what i'm talking about all right so the vest is adjustable um, as far as the waist straps in the cummerbund area that i showed you so you can adjust that according to your waist area and let me show you how that works so basically what you do is velcro right in this area here guys you just simply lift up on that area here and uh just like so look at that and you have all of this Velcro here, okay? And then they have the loop here and they have the loop here. You just simply take the loop or you can take it from the corner, un-Velcro it, 
I mean, it's tough too, guys. Um, and then you can adjust it, all right? So if you're a bigger guy and you need more room in the waist area, you can just kind of adjust it um, to fit. And so you would just simply just kind of move it up a little bit more, like right there. And then you can do the other one the same way, and that'll give you more room in the waist area. If you're a smaller guy, you're probably going to have to just move it uh, in a little bit. So it comes standard just like that, but you probably have to move it in a little bit more. If you're a smaller guy to fit the waist area, you can move it in just like that. So I thought that was pretty cool. Yeah, they made this thing pretty, pretty hardcore. And then you just close it up just like that. Right here, guys, you have your magazine pouch area. And I'll unvelcro that. And then that way you can put your regular magazines for handguns in this area here. Looks like they have one. Uh, you have two, um, three, my first time on Velcroing these. And then you have um, four right here. And you can just put your mag down there and there's plenty of room, as you can see, right in that area to put it down in the inside. You can also unsnap this area here, which is cool, guys. It's all type of surprises with this. So if you unsnap that, if you unsnap that, and if you unsnap that, it'll snap unsnap again, but I'm not going to do it again. You can see the molly webbing in the inside here, all right? Which means you can take this area out and, you know, add different pouches on here. Of course, the kind that you like. Um, so it, it looks like it doesn't necessarily have to be this type of brand. It looks like you can add, you know, different pouches from other brands on the, on the front if you want to, or just Molly web something else um, in this area right here. So I thought that was pretty cool. So I'll button that, button that back up. And I mean, it goes on there really good too. You also have your tension bands in this area too. Now, this is a little surprise, guys. And a matter of fact, I just freaking found this out <laughs> while I'm doing a review here. But you even have room for your larger capacity magazines to go in this area. It's crazy. So you have one right here. Uh, you have one right there, it looks like. And then you have a third one uh, right here, guys. Let me try to get it in the camera for you. A third one right there. Uh, that you can put your magazines in. So that's pretty freaking cool uh, that you get three areas right there. So it's kind of hidden and you might miss that when you get the vest, but you can see it right there. And of course you have the tension bands there to hold those magazines down. So that's crazy. Standard magazines, you get one, two, three, four um, here. Uh, one, two, three. And then there's one more here that you probably can't see. The vest is so big. And then you get three of them, like I said, in this area here, one, two where my thumb is at and then i'll move it around and then you got three right there guys so that's pretty damn good all right guys i'm also going to show you where you can put your plates in the inside here now the plates that i have are from rts tactical guys and these plates are hardcore these are the rhesus plates okay all right, and these will most definitely protect you. We did some crazy, crazy major tests uh, out there in the outdoor range at OK Corral. Tell me when you're ready. Everybody got eyes and ears on good? Eyes and ears on. Good. All right. Send it. Woo! I was out there, I believe, with um, uh, Nathan uh, and Christine, and they helped me out with that video, guys. But this right here is a crazy hardcore pl uh, plate. Make sure that you check it out in the description below. I'll have the link for these plates, but basically when a round hits this plate, it basically just absorbs it. And I have all the details in the video for you also, guys. So these are the plates that I run. So I'm gonna go ahead and show you real quick how to insert it inside the front of it, okay? And also you can insert one in the back of it, but I'm just simply gonna insert it in the front, all right? So let's go ahead and do it. And I'll go ahead and show you now, this is the inside of it. All right, right there. That's where you put the plates. Then the inside, it also has straps here, guys, so you can strap down the plates, all right? Just like that. So I'm gonna go ahead real quick for you and put the plate in. Velcro, and I mean, the Velcro is real strong, too. It's crazy. All right, I'm sliding the plate in now, guys.
There you go. So now what I'm gonna simply do right here, the plate is in, and I'm gonna go ahead for you real quick and then strap it down. Like I said, this Velcro, once it gets stuck in the inside, it's pretty tough stuff. All right, so just Velcro it across the top of the plate like that. Take the other one, Velcro it across the top. And you take that little flap right there. And all you do is just, you know, cuff it under and then close it. And that's exactly how you put your plate inside it, okay? Super easy. And there it is, guys. Just like so. Perfect. You'll see the size of the plates below on the screen. So that's basically the size that you can fit inside these uh, plate carriers, okay? All right, so that's that. I'm not gonna show you, I'm not gonna put a plate in the inside of the back of it, but I will show you the area where you can insert it. So it's in the same area, guys. In that area right there, all right? And then you also have your straps right here. Um, so you can just strap it across the top of the actual plate and that way it holds it in place in the inside and then you just cuff it like that and close it. Same thing. All right, so now guys, we are looking at how it fits. Uh, I was a little tired this night, um, you know, putting in some work recording, but put together a pretty good video. And um, right here, I'm just kind of making sure it's nice and fitted. Um, you know, and as I said before, in the cummerbund area, you can tighten it up or loosen it up depending on your waist size. Um, and it doesn't feel crazy loose or anything like that. And I didn't even really have to adjust anything. All right, that's a side view right there, how it looks. You know, you have your magazines on the side, the pouches on the side, that one pouch on the side, and then you have in the cummerbund area you have where you can put magazines also all right and there goes those loops i was talking about now you can pull um and you'll see you can pull up or you can pull down on that and it'll release so that's your quick release right there all right just putting it back on right there and uh i mean it's on guys feels good too i like it like it a lot. Let me know in the comments below what you guys think about this, you know, and if you already have a, you know, chest plate carrier, or let us know. All right, so I appreciate you all watching the video to the end. Hopefully I hit all of the intricate details on this uh, vest. This is a sweet vest, guys. And like I said before, it's a lot of crappy vests out there. But this one right here for the price is top notch, all right? Make sure you check me out on Rumble, guys. You will see it right here on the screen below on Rumble. I'm also on Instagram. Uh, you can check me out on there, too. And go ahead and explore my About section. If you go on the channel, you can go to the About section, and you'll see many different affiliates that I'm associated with, guys. So just click on one of those links. You'll see Palmetto State Armory, RTS Tactical on there. Of course, you all shop all the time with the Amazon link, so I appreciate that. That helps support the channel. Guys, before we go, I wanna give a super big shout out to the United States, Brazil, Mexico, and also India, guys. They watch this channel a lot, and I truly, truly appreciate it. Of course, I gotta shout out some cities too. Dallas, Texas, you guys watch my channel like crazy, so I appreciate you all coming through to the channel too. California, I haven't forgotten about you. Los Angeles, I see you out there in the analytics. I see you all in the analytics watching the videos, and I appreciate the love too, guys. Please like, comment, subscribe. Smash that notification bell so when I roll out the latest videos, you'll be able to receive them. And remember, I'm not from this planet.